Good evening, I'm Brandon Carlson, bringing you breaking news from Kenya. In a historic move, President William Ruto has appointed the first female commander of the Air Force, marking a significant milestone in the nation's military history. Major General Fatuma Gadi Ahmed has been appointed as the first woman to lead one of Kenya's military services, taking the helm as the commander of the Air Force. This appointment comes alongside other significant changes in military leadership following the tragic loss of the previous military chief and others in a recent helicopter crash. Alongside Major General Ahmed's appointment, General Charles Kahariri has been promoted to fill the vacant position. Major General Ahmed's illustrious career has been marked by several groundbreaking achievements in a traditionally male-dominated field. Notably, she became the first woman to rise to the ranks of Brigadier and Major General within the Kenyan military. Her journey began in 1983, when she joined the military under the Women's Service Course, a pioneering unit dedicated to women's service which operated separately from other branches of the Defence Forces. Initially tasked with support duties such as administration, logistics, medical, and communication, the Women's Service Corps provided a platform for women like Major General Ahmed to excel. However, it wasn't until the unit was disbanded in 1999 that its members were permitted to join the mainstream military services, including the Navy, Air Force, and Army. This expansion of opportunities allowed Major General Ahmed and others to progress through the ranks and demonstrate their capabilities in military leadership. I, Fatma Gaiti Ahmed, Commander of the Kenya Air Force, do swear in the name of the Almighty God that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to the... Rep a positive role model for women across the country during her promotion to Major General in 2018. In an interview with Citizen TV in 2018, Major General Ahmed revealed that despite facing discouragement from some family members who believed the military was not a suitable profession for women, she remained determined to make a difference in her life. Inspired by an uncle who served in the military, she embraced the values of discipline and hard work that have guided her throughout her career. Major General Fatuma Gaiti Ahmed's appointment as the first female commander. Major General Fatuma Gaiti Ahmed's appointment as the first female commander of the Air Force symbolizes a significant milestone in Kenya's military history, underscoring the nation's commitment to promoting gender inclusivity and recognizing the invaluable contributions of women in all spheres of society. This is Brandon Carlson reporting for Breaking News TV. Stay tuned for further updates on this developing story.